In this video, we're going to show you how to um, adjust the width of your last by building up little leather patches on the sides. Um, you can see this is sort of a standard size last, but it's a little bit narrow, so sometimes people like to add some width like this for a better fit. So come on over and let me show you how. I'm going to start with just a little piece of veg tan leather like this. Um, I'm just going to put one on, but you might need to add up two layers or three layers depending on how wide you need the um, side to be. So first thing I'm going to do is take some glue. And I'm just going to glue straight onto the last like that. And I'm going to glue the back of that piece of leather. And just to speed up the drying process, I'm going to give it a quick blast with the heat gun. Okay, so once you've given this glue enough time to dry, you can just take your leather and stick it onto the side there like that. And we really want to wrap it up the side of the last. I sometimes give it a little tap with a hammer just to make sure it's sitting flush. no air bubbles in there now. All right, so what we need to do here is skive down the edges so that they're flush. Here's one that I prepared earlier so you can see how it should look, sort of something like that. So what we're gonna do is use the safety beveler and we're just gonna work our way around the edges first. This way we're keeping the full width in the middle but we're just smoothing it out to the shape of the last on the sides. Okay, you can see at that stage how much width I have actually already added there. If it's not quite as smooth as you'd like it to be, you can take some sandpaper and just give it a little smooth. Right, so sometimes that is enough, sometimes it's not. If you need it on both sides, you can of course put another one on the other side. If you need one side to be even wider, you can layer up extra pieces of leather to make them um, fit whatever size you need it to fit. And the great thing about this method is that you can actually reuse them. So I sometimes, once I'm finished with them, will just peel it off like that and then use the last normally as it is and then when I need it to be an extra wide last again I would literally just glue that back on in the same position that I had it before. Um, so here I have an example of a high heel last where we have built it up on both sides and you can see from underneath just how much width it really has added on there. Um, so yeah. If you did want to change the shape of the toe of your lasts, you can do that um, with a different method. We use a product called Milliput to build it up and then we sand it down into shape. And we've also got another video on how to do that. So check in the comments below.